enough. Get your out of here. First on Fox 13, a fight over a camping spot in Utah, all caught on camera. Tonight, it's spawning death threats online. Good evening, everyone. I'm Hope Woodside. And I'm Bob Evans. The Cache County Sheriff's Office is investigating, but the man who could face charges says you're only seeing half the story. Fox 13's Matt McDonald joins us in studio tonight to get to the bottom of this. Matt. Hey, Bob and Hope. Take a look. That guy right there in the red tank top is Wyatt Pack. He's arguing with the Caballero family over the Memorial Day weekend. This dispute started over a camping spot in Blacksmith Fork Canyon, but this video is keeping the fight going. He went up to my dad and then he was like, um, are you deaf? And he started grabbing him by the ear and like yelling in his ear like, do these work? Are they deaf? Are you deaf? Do these work? I got pretty close to him. I never touched him though. This argument was on Monday evening in Blacksmith Fork Canyon. The Caballeros say their truck broke down. It was partially blocking another camping spot. I couldn't even turn into the camp because of the way that they had all their stuff set up. The heated argument got posted online, but only 12 minutes worth. This happened for about three hours and you got 11 minutes, maybe 12 minutes of video. Corey and Wyatt say for hours they tried to help, but things got heated. I feared that my family was starting to get in danger. That's why my voice changed and started yelling. The online comments have made Wyatt even more fearful. It's blown out of proportion. It needs to add the death threats. Nobody wants this stuff. The Caballeros say they're the ones that had a reason to be scared. The men behind them, they all had guns and they never pointed at my family with the guns, but their hands were at their waist where the guns were at. So my dad was really scared. So I'll tell you what, we'll get that trailer out of the way if you're gonna move the truck. We can do yeah. that. But you're gonna pay us. Right. How much money do you got? The Caballeros eventually handed over about 40 bucks and their stuff was towed down the canyon. Looking back at it now, I think that it, we all should have just walked away from each other and calmed down. So I, I do apologize for getting so worked up. So it's not just the death threats online. Because he mentioned his employer, Weber County, in the video, Wyatt has been placed on paid administrative leave while the investigation is done. Meanwhile, the Cache County Sheriff's Office has its own investigation going. They've now turned the case over to the county attorney to screen it for charges. Matt McDonald, Fox 13 News, Utah.